Hello again, and welcome to today's attempt at the Fibble Puzzle. This is Wordle, but there's a liar in every row, so maybe the S is lying, and it shouldn't be green. But then should it be yellow or grey instead? Who knows? Or maybe the L, O, P, or E is lying instead. The only way to find out is to play. So it's auto-populated that first guess, as usual, and it's been quite nice to us, because it's given us three letters that are either yellow or green. And only one of those can be lying, at most, which means that we've already got at least two letters correct. I'm going to keep the S and the E in position, and let's do stare. That lets me try some really common letters. Right, neither the S nor the E has changed colour, which is not really what I was hoping for. Um, I'm going to take a random guess that the P and the A are the ones that are lying, which means that we only have two bits of information to go on, the S and the E. So let's try sinew. Interesting. Again, I think it's most likely that the W is lying, because it's the least common letter there. So if it's if it is the W that's lying, that means that the E has to be second or third. We're running out of places for it. So I'm thinking maybe an S H E beginning. Can't be sheep, of course, because we now can't put the E in fourth. And also that would mean there's no liar on the top row. What should I go for? The other option, of course, is that the E is second. But I cannot see anything that works with that. I suppose it could be specifically the word CD. Do I want to waste a guess on that? I don't usually like duplicating a letter, but yeah, on this occasion, let's just go for it. And just It will probably give me the information that all of my assumptions thus far have been completely wrong. So I think it's worth a try. Right, so surely the S is lying. If the S is actually not lying here, that means it's lying everywhere else, which means that the A, P, E and W are all in the words, which is plausible but very unlikely. So surely that means the S is lying here. So that means there is only a single E, and it is in this position. So we were right in all of these, I think. But what on earth are we going to do What on earth are we going to do? So we're back to where I was a minute ago with it being S in position one and E in position three and not knowing what on earth else to do. I mean, there's a chance that the W lying should actually be yellow rather than green, because then it would be S, we could use it somewhere else, second or fourth. But I don't think that is particularly likely. I suppose, oh no, I was, I was going to say we could use the L and the T, but we can't unless we also use the A and the P, so that's clearly not right. I think some of my assumptions up here are wrong. Maybe, let's put that back in, maybe my assumption about the P was wrong, or maybe yeah, maybe the P is actually not lying and the L is lying, because it could be spell. Again, I don't really like to duplicate a letter if I can help it, but spell definitely could be correct, I think. So let's try it and see what happens. Oh, wow. Everything's gone wrong. Right. So we know that the E is third. So that's the lie here. So there's definitely no P or L. So that means the P is definitely lying, which is what I said all along. What on earth are we going to do? Okay, so maybe the A is not lying here. Maybe, oh, I suppose the R or the T could be lying. And in fact, we actually had four letters correct on this row. Um, I mean, it could even be swear. We could have had the W correct up here and it was lying. And it was actually yellow instead of green. Because I just assumed it was grey. I think swear is probably more likely, but let's go for smear first. Very happy to get it on that guess. I mean, it could have been sheer with an H in second. There were quite a few options. At least we ruled out spear. <laughs> that was about the only good news there. So I got a little bit lucky, but also that was not my best performance. I got very unlucky, I think, by the fact that 
I assumed the A was lying when in fact it was the R. I think it was much more likely that the A was lying. So that took me five guesses because of course the top one was auto populated. It's definitely not my best, but it's also not my worst, so I can't really complain. Let me know if you were shouting smear at the screen. And if you were, let me know how many people around you gave you strange looks. That's the Fibble Puzzle. Thank you for watching and bye for now.